in Florida, they have a two-day training program. Okay. Okay, pull in uh, all these sort of subject matter experts about child development, what's a healthy family and what's unhealthy. Okay. And, all, and right. all you that sort of stuff. You know about that stuff. Yeah. yeah. And then they say, um, okay, if you want to do this, uh, we'll give you a mentor and we'll pair you up with somebody for six months or whatever, month, whatever time it takes kind of thing. Okay. Uh, and then we'll release you and say, go observe some families. Go watch what is going on with these children that we're talking about. Okay. And at some point, uh, some judge is going to say to you, so mm-hmm. what do you think? You As to whether they, you've uh, measured up, I yep. guess, in some ways. Right? Yep. And, and essentially there are two parties sort of at well three parties at the table you have the parent it's mm-hmm. typically in, in our case a lot of women mm-hmm. rarely is it is it men men seem to get off the hook with this stuff i don't uh, yeah well that's it's, that's a that's a long discussion probably yeah. in a way but but yeah. also um single parent yeah. i take it yes yeah. I mean, yeah, for or, the most or, part yeah, because you, you, you may not see a couple coming in with with the kid who has the right. problem together because that's, that right. that, that's a hopeful sign almost. I, I would exactly. Think that that's in fact, yeah, kind that, of what you're hoping for exactly. in a way. But that would even feel better if that were the case. But mostly women. Mostly women. Okay, so so essentially you have the state uh, who put her on some kind of plan where she's supposed to correct the things that were the problem. Right. So they're giving the parent uh, a, a chance exactly. there yeah. to kind of help this kid out before the state does more. That's right. With him, a little more invasive. So, maybe so, th- so they'll give her whatever six months or something, and they'll say to her, "Look, uh, if you've got a substance abuse, we want you in substance abuse treatment. If you're uh, d- domestic violence, we want you to get into some trauma therapy and take a look at that and see what's going on with all okay. that kind of thing." Okay. Um, and if it's a parenting issue, we want you in a parenting program. If it's an anger management, we want you in that or whatever it is. Okay. So the state basically says, look, parent, here's what it is we expect. So while that's going on, some caregiver somewhere. Right. Can be like grandma, can be Aunt Tilly, can be <laughs> you know, any, any, anything, yeah. you know, whatever, is taking care of two or three of these kids who've yes. been abandoned or rejected or, or they're housing them or, they're housing they're taking care of they when yeah. you say taking care of they really exactly. are they really are they're they changing are diapers their food clothing shelter they're getting okay. into school if it's school whatever you're yeah getting. and they get a stipend from the state or something yeah, they get paid yeah. for that All right um and so the deal is the guardian ad litem once a month goes in and observes what's happening in the home Okay. Okay. And reports back to reports back to the judge. To the judge. Okay. And e- either says, uh, "Hey, what's going on here is wonderful, and it's a healthy place for the kid," or might say, "That's really not a very desirable location. We need to come okay. up with something else okay. or whatever." Um, and if Mama has done her plan, right? Okay. And yep. She's hopefully clicked off all the boxes she's done adequate visitation she shows up you know once or twice a week oh okay so I, I see so it's not just you sort of evaluating or the guardian ad litem evaluating right. the home that they're currently in with the person that's doing the caretaking but also the mother still in, engaged with the child okay that's right and a uh, school system uh, okay. I, i'll end up in a school system Checking on grades, checking on socialization. How's the kid doing? What's his absentee rate is, or whatever. Okay, you going to a parent-teacher conference, conference with this? Okay, man. What are they called? I, I, you know, EIP. No, the uh, yeah, whatever the, uh, that is. Whatever the initials yeah. are. I'll go to one of those and sit and listen. To e- whatever. Uh, I'll sit and listen to you know them talk about the kid and is the kid on track or off track or whatever it is. Does the kid need reading? Does the kid need speech therapy? Does the kid need math? You know. And what's the school going to do about it and all that kind of thing? Yeah. And so at some, yeah. at some point, I've gathered enough information. Judge will say to me, what do you think what ought to happen? Think? Yeah, at this point, yeah. And then I basically have to say, okay, here's what I think ought to happen. And uh, sometimes the judge says, fine, we'll make that happen. And sometimes the judge says, I think you're crazy. Or, no, you're off the mark. You're there. off the you mark. May, you, you may go back, try again or something. Yeah. But wow, that's a lot of responsibility, though, Rick. I'm thinking, um, 
You, do you have a uh, sort of a checklist? I know you probably got good gut instincts on what's right in, in the situation, yeah. but does, are they saying, hey, check for these things, or how does that, it, how does that happen? It probably is much my own checklist. You know, okay. I, I'm looking for adequate nurturing right. in that situation. Sure. Is somebody giving that kid a hug when that kid needs, you know, falls yeah. down, picked up, or whatever it is that's there? I'm looking for some level of discipline structure, mm-hmm. something where there's a bedtime hour, there's some stories being read, there's bath time, there's you know, just stuff, right. stuff that. Oh my! I didn't. I didn't ask this. Yeah. Really. What are the ages of these kids we're talking? Well, they yeah. would be less than eighteen. Okay. Most of the ones that that uh, I've been working in recently are under six. All right, let me. Uh, young kids. Yep. So that's, I got I got the idea. All right, so let me cut to the chase. Um, okay. How how are you doing with it? How well are you doing your job? What's your self evaluation uh, in terms of helping these kids out? Because I got a feeling you you're helping out. But, okay. But what do you? How do you evaluate yourself? <laughs> I've recently been moved to I mentor. Okay. The guardian ad lighter. Oh well, now okay. you, they they made you the supervisor. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. You just got there five minutes ago. Well, what, what just happened? It, it, it did no, happen. they recognize some expertise. Yeah, yeah, All right, yeah, give yeah, it yeah, give yeah. it up okay. right there okay. for Rick. Okay. Right. So the so the deal is, they'll call and say Sally wants to be a guardian ad lighter. Would you work with Sally? Okay. Yeah. And so, but in a way, I'm looking for the same kind of thing. I want to know right. can Sally go into a space. And pay attention you know, right, to what's right, going right, on. Right. Does, does she notice clean diapers or dirty diapers? Does she notice children who've been fed or haven't been fed? Does she notice tissues there if they've got a cold or whatever? It is so not so or you're deep. you're actually in the trainer position. Yeah, yeah. And do you do any training with these folks, or yeah. you just got, like when they come on board, you say, yeah. okay, here's what I want to know from you. Here's what you need to know. No, I, I, I get them and kind of move them through, you know, like a courtroom observation. I, okay. I get them to spend a day in court. We talk about what did you see, what were the arguments that seemed. To oh, that's that. You know, I got a feeling this is just right up your alley. You must be <laughs> really enjoying this it to is, a certain it extent. Is, it is. It is. It is. Because I always thought that that sometimes, as a supervi- clinical supervisor, I thought, well, sometimes we're like a backseat driver uh, um, uh, or Monday morning quarterback. We're kind of like we're it. looking over the shoulder and saying, "Hey, you might pay attention to yeah, this over here. Is, what do you that, think?" That and kind of get back to it. But yeah. oh yeah, that's fun. That fits right in with your supervision training it, it, it really and, does. and experience. It does. And, and and the other sort of part that, uh, because these are uh, people who've come out of, for the most part, pretty healthy families, that mm-hmm. is, the guardian ad litems that I'm training, they have fairly high expectations about what they think normal ought to be. Okay. And okay. sometimes you have to reel them back in a little bit. You know, yeah, maybe. so they're, they're projecting on this ideal family kind of yeah, that you may, yeah. cannot be yep. measured up exactly kind of thing. you know and they can they can walk in and the tv's blaring and right. they, they get upset and then they go to the judge and say it's a bad home because the tv was blaring well really well, that's, that's a cultural, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, or, yeah, or they right, go right, in right. and the music is hard rock stuff or whatever right it is. i don't like that i don't, I don't like that exactly that <laughs> type of music okay <laughs> exactly. there we go <laughs> or it's, it's it's rap and they go well rap is really bad oh, for rap kids. Is and, and so, so you have to kind of reel them in and say okay yeah wait, wait, wait. yeah yeah that's a bias Let's take a look at your bias. So yeah, and making the, making it making a difference between you know the thing that sort of triggers the something about harm to the child That's or right. inappropriate in so many different That's ways, right. as opposed to maybe a taste or a style That's or right. something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So a lot of the That's work, interesting. you know, the, the tricky work is just to you know pay attention and pick up a bias. All right. So the answer the answer to my question is yeah. you are definitely enjoying this work yeah. right now. Like so, this work. 